In this video, I'll show you how to connect your Canon image class MF3010 to your Mac computer. So let's get started right away and also show you how to print using your computer to this new printer. So I'll show you how to connect and also how to print. In the package, you may have found out that it comes with a cable. And this is very important because this printer does not have any Wi-Fi, any wireless capabilities. You'll need to have this cable. If you have lost the original cable, I'll put a link in the description to get another one from Amazon. In the box, you also get the driver that is very important for your computer. Unfortunately, most computers these days don't have any way to input a CD. So we'll get this driver from the Canon website. Let me show you. You should not connect this cable at this moment. I'll tell you when. First, we need to down download the driver on your computer and then connect it. So we'll open a web browser. I'll open my Safari. So in Google, we're going to type Canon and the model name, which is MF3010. Enter. Go down and usually going to have the first options from the official Canon website. This is the Canadian website since I'm located in Canada. But if you're in another country, you should see the Canon website for, for your country. If you don't see anything like that, just simply go down and you should see Canon Software America or something like that. I'll click here. Maybe it's easier for you. Now we're going to click on downloads, software and driver. Over here, first step is select and identify operating system. Over here, we're using a Mac, so you should select Mac. Over there, where it says select version, you should need to select the version of your Mac OS. How do you know that? Click the small Apple logo on the top left corner, then about this Mac. And here you should see the version. I'm running 12.7 Monterey. So I'll select here version 12 Monterey, but yours may be different. Then go down and select the first option, MF printer driver and utilities for Mac. Press the download button, allow, and wait until it's downloaded. Once it's downloaded, go ahead, open. So I went in my downloads. This is the file that got downloaded. Open it. Then double click on the MF printer installer package. From here, you're going to go and press continue. Continue, agree, install. Now you have to type the username and the password of this computer to allow this download to be installed. Now you just have to wait. At the end, you should have add printer display on the screen and you just have to close. Then move to trash. You can now exit by Clicking here, closing this down, you don't need this as well. Now it's time to take the actual cable. And since most Mac have only have USB type C ports, like this one, this is a MacBook Air and it has two USB type C ports. So we'll need an adapter so that this USB type A can connect. I highly recommend this adapter. It's made by Apple, so you know for sure that it will work. I'll put a link in the description if you want to get one from Amazon. So you just have to connect the cable like this and the other end in your Mac computer. And this end will go on the back of the printer, right above the power cable. Now on your Mac computer, we need to go into the settings. So click the Apple logo on the top left corner, then system preferences. Then we need to go back here. This is the main menu, main settings. 
you need to go into printers and scanners. Maybe you're running a more newer version of Mac OS and it will not look like this. Don't worry, I'll put on the screen how it should look and where you should click, so printers and scanners. And from here you're gonna have all your printers and scanners that are connected with your um, Mac. We need to add this printer, so what we'll, what we'll need to do is to press this lock. Um, enter again the password of this computer. Now that the lock is unlocked, we're gonna press this plus icon. And from this list, you're gonna select the Canon printer. Again, maybe it's looking a bit different on your computer. Don't worry, it should uh, have the same options. Then press add. Perfect. The Canon printer has been added to the list and since it has a green dot, it means we're ready to print. Open any document you wish to print. Let's say I wanna print this image. I'll go ahead. If if it's a file on a computer, if it's a picture, open it, a PDF file, open it. Then we're gonna do, we're gonna keep press command and the letter P, so the print dialog will open on your Mac screen. And then you need to select how many copies you want and make sure that printer, the Canon MF3010 is selected. Once you're ready, press print. And here we go, we got our print. Obviously, uh, people won't use this for images, mostly for text, but hey, you see, it works. So this is it, it's quite simple. Once uh, you finish printing, you can disconnect this cable, you don't have to do anything else, or you can keep it connected permanently, permanently to your computer. It's up to you. But unfortunately, it does not have any Wi-Fi. Thanks for watching. Please leave a like, subscribe, check my Amazon affiliate links down below. If you'd like to get the adapter or some paper, some toner for this specific printer, and I'll see you in the next video.